Okay, so, um, I downloaded a whole bunch of Nintendo games, and I was scanning through them last night, and I saw one that looked familiar. Um, apparently, <coughs> the Nintendo and the Super Nintendo both have an Earthbound. They look the same. I mean, they're named the same, but they're different games. Because I started it up last night just to see what it was. Uh, because I thought that it had just uh, messed up and like confused the SNES version with the NES version and put it in the wrong set. Because I have the SNES version as well. But no. The NES version is Earthbound 1. Or Mother 1. And that's what I'm going to be playing today. Produced by Shigesato Itoi. Same person that did the other one. Boy's name. Wait, what button do I push to? boy's name. Uh, I don't know. Sam. Sam in all caps because he's an asshole. This last boy's name? Uh, Ryan. My buddy Ryan in the Navy. I'll play with him. Favorite food. Weed. Just give me a big bowl of weed. This is correct. In the early 1900s, a dark shadow covered a small country town in rural America. <laughs> At that time, a young married couple vanished mysteriously from their home. The man's name was George. The woman's name was Maria. Two years later, as suddenly as he left, George returned. He never told anyone where he had been or what he had done, but he began an odd study, all by himself. As for Maria, his wife, she never returned. That's kind of sad. Dark. Eighty years have passed since then. Okay. Now I did do this part earlier, and the lamp is going to attack me. So I wonder if I can like attack it first. What am I doing wrong? I guess I'm hitting the wrong button. Okay. No problem, bitch. I know there's going to be a problem. Okay. Try to leave. Yep. Lamp draws near. Apparently, I'm hurt though. Alright. Oh, 
lamp draws near. Lamp attacks. Oh my, brother, our house is falling apart. Boo hoo. See, this is already different because, um, when I played last night, she was being attacked by a doll, and there was something in the doll. Help me! Oh, this is the room with the doll. Doll draws near. It's so creepy looking. It's all naked and shit. Why does it gotta be naked? Like, yeah, I dodged that shit. Oh. Doll has got some damn energy. <laughs> there it goes. Doll doesn't move anymore. Ah, next level, cool. Speed up. Wisdom up. I don't know how I'm any smarter from fighting a doll, but okay. The phenomenon has stopped for the moment. Okay, go to the doll. Check it. An old music box. As the music box was wound up, a melody began to play. Adra remembered the tune. Brother, here's some juice. You are thirsty, aren't you? I guess. Guess I'm not blinking anymore. So this is where I stopped last night, so everything from here is completely new to me. Are you alright? Egad, what is happening to our house? I wish your dad were here now. Please get the phone. Adra grabbed the telephone. This is your dad. Well, it seems like a poltergeist. I'm not exactly sure how, but your great-grandfather studied PSI. You might find something in the basement to help. But I left the basement key someplace. I can't remember exactly where. Anyhow, son, you are my only hope. It's time for you to go on a little adventure and explore the potential of your powers. Powers not to be taken lightly. Adra, go for it. But remember to come back and check on your family. Bye. Oh, phone me and I'll save your progress. Call me whenever you want. Okay. I already did this. Okay, do I go down to the basement? The door's locked. Okay. Outside? Let's see if the dog knows what's happening. You can converse with animals! Tell you a secret, why don't you check me out? Bow wow. There on the dog's collar was the basement key. Oh, that's handy. This is 
signs say? Address house. Oh, okay. It's kind of small, but... Oh, now everybody's downstairs. I am Minnie. What can I do for you? You haven't left... Oh, okay. I guess she's like a storage person. She holds stuff. It's weird. Well, I know the door's locked. I have a key. Oh. Oh. Heck yeah. Hey, there's a bunch of presents. Adra opened the present. There was a diary. Okay. Oh shit, this one's gonna attack me. Oh, it's a rat. It's such fun, lively music for fighting a rat in a basement. Got him. Rat became quiet. Why is that so creepy? Things stop moving and become quiet. There was bread. Plastic bat. Alright, see if I can equip it. Great grandfather's diary, plastic bat. Yeah, yeah. Alright, let's check out the diary. Jeez. The diary was hard to read, but opened up to this page. The one who lost the tail, the forgotten one, the ship. I guess my banner thing is gonna mess up a lot of stuff. Okay. This is your dad. I've transferred $52 into your account. After the amount you've spent, the balance is $52. Spend your money wisely. The next level requires fifteen dollars. Good night. Okay, I'm going to restart without my banner to see if I can, because I'm having trouble reading. <laughs> 